I'll wait here a few minutes and people will start joining. We have one. Hello there, who's that? We got a couple of people. Hi, Zach. Good to see you, buddy. We got something fun tonight. I'm excited about this. Thanks for joining us. We got 17 people in about 30 seconds. That's great. Hi, Paul. Good to see you. Hi, Chris. Welcome. Hi, Kendall. Good to see you, man. Hi, Bobby. Hi, Paul. Hi, Kate. All my friends are here. Hi, Rich. Hi, JT. Daniel. How are you? Good to see all you guys. Okay, we're going to start, even though I say we're going to start at 6 o'clock, I'm going to give everybody about two minutes before we actually start this thing, and then we'll get it going. Good to see everybody, though. I'm glad you guys are here. I've missed you. Hi, Michael. First time I've gotten to see you. Wow. Hi, Michael. I'm glad you're here. Welcome. Hi, Justin. Hi, Nick. Hi, John. Hey, Trey. Jeremy. Hey, buddy. I'll wait just like another minute or so. We'll get started. Check out this, you guys. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Big Barlow's Lucifer's Load. You heard me correct. It's Lucifer's Load. Hi, Vern. Hi, Robert. Chris Murray. Hey, Darren. Okay, we'll get this thing started. About one more, maybe 30 more seconds, and we'll start this. Let me tell you a little bit about the uh, what I'm reviewing today. Um, I got this just today, and I plan on doing this down the road a little bit, but it's a flask, you guys. You guys get that, right? It's a flask. It's a real stainless steel flask. This is the coolest thing in the world. And when I saw it, I was like, I didn't really have something planned to do live tonight. And I thought, hey, why not? Hey, Brandon. So I thought, let's do this. Um, this was sent to me by Chris and Danielle Barlow. They own Big Barlow Sauces. Um, pretty exciting. Um, Chris Murray wants a shout out. Hey, Chris, there's your shout out, buddy. Um, their website is bigbarlowsauces.com. I'm going to post their fa Facebook uh, link in the description below, the description box, and a link uh, to their website. But they have products called Ass Reaper. Uh, electric death sauce and that Lucifer's load Ashe how you doing buddy there's Chris Barlow okay so let me uh, can you guys all hear me okay the sound is low on me let me see hang on Can't make it any louder. I hope you guys can hear me okay. I'll try to be a little bit louder. The speakers, this is as loud as it's going to get. So I'll do the best I can. So hopefully you guys can hear me okay. Let me share with you what's in Lucifer's Load. Okay, you guys? The ingredients are Barakpur uh, peppers, Buchalokia, pure pepper extract. Uh, Maruga, uh, Trinidad Maruga Scorpions, Carolina Reapers. Hi, Danielle Barlow. Thanks for joining us. Thank you so much for saying this to me. Hi, Troy. Um, vinegar, uh, cider vinegar, salt, apricot, and garlic. There's some really cool things in here. But I just love the marketing. I love the way this comes to you. And by the way, how cool is that? Chris signed the back of my flask. I just think, and this is a real flask, you guys. Let me show you. you unscrew the top. And this is the real deal. Okay, so let me tell you what I'm smelling here, you guys. Boy, it's hot. 
I can pick up a little bit of the garlic, maybe even a little bit of the apricot. But boy, those peppers are right in your face. You guys can't hear me. Is this a little better? Can you hear me a little better now or not? Hi, Christine. Can you guys hear me okay or what? Is it just you can't hear me? I hope you guys can hear me. Anyway, so we're going to try this right now. All right? This is Lucifer's Load. why you guys can't hear me. I wish you could. See, some, a few people can hear me. All right, anyway. Boy, it just smells crazy hot, you guys. All right, so here we go. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Danielle. We're going to chase some heat right now. Oh, by the way, I asked him what the Scovilles were on this. He thinks it's a little bit north of uh, 2 million. It's kind of hot. So here we go. Chase the heat. Wow. <clears throat> All right. You guys, if you've, I know Michael, it's the first time he's seen the show. A lot of you guys have seen this before. You guys, I say this, if it's worth doing, if it's worth doing, it's worth what? Overdoing. So we're going to have a little bit more. Here we go. Well, the flavor, the great garlic, the garlic flavor is right there. You can definitely taste the apricot, which is really neat, because sometimes you, you get apricot, apricot sauces, the apricot is so faint. And I'm trying to taste the extract, because some people find it unpleasant. I can't find any extract. I had to do that, right? Because if it's worth doing, it's worth overdoing. All right, so I believe him when he says it's 2 million Scoville units. I believe him. This is Big Barlow's Lucifer's Load. Um, it's a hot sauce, you guys. Um, I promise you, I can't pick up any extract flavor at all. All I'm getting is peppers, garlic, and the apricot. Just a little bit more. I wish the flax were just a little bit bigger. John. Here we go. Wow. Proudly made right here in the USA. They're, they're from New Jersey, you guys. Um, again, it's um, bigbarlowsauces.com. You're going to see a link in the description below um, for the website I just gave you and their Facebook. This is no joke. This is hot. It's a hot sauce, you guys. It's got great flavor. It's not... Um, sometimes... <clears throat> If you get some sauces that are above a couple million in Scoville, um, it's just hot and you don't really have much flavor. You know what I mean? It's just, 
you know, it's kind of flame in your face. Um, this is great flavor. The flavor is there. And when I was talking to him earlier, he said flavors first. It's really important to him. Um, the flavor is here. And Darren says it's awesome. It comes in a flask. It is. It's a flask of fire, you guys. I think this is, you know, I've seen him in uh, stuff products that um, some come in uh, grenades and some cool marketing. Um, this is about the coolest marketing I've ever seen. <clears throat> and hot, still climbing. The burn um, started off in the front of my mouth. It's moving its way back. It's right here in the back of my throat right now. I don't know if Desiree's here. I want to say hi to Desiree today, too. Um, but boy, um, how much can you taste the apricot, Paul asks. Um, it's a good question. You can taste it, you know, when I first tasted it. Sometimes you get, um, so I've had sauces with apricot, where the apricot is so, i got to stop drinking it. I'm going to drink it all. Where the apricot is so faint, you can't really taste it. It's, it's pronounced. I mean, you can taste it. It's apricot, it's garlic, and it's just in-your-face pepper, so... Um, and you can fill it with booze and take it shopping. No, I'd be the guy that would have this in his jacket and they'd be watching me drink it. They'd think I was drinking booze and I'm not. I'm drinking Lucifer's hot sauce. Um, there's De De Desiree. How are you? Good to see you, Desiree. Hey, Ron. Um, and Larry. Boy, this was great. I don't know what was wrong with the volume. Guys, I want to tell you something really cool. Ken, uh, Kendall uh, Stadler's uh, tuned in, and he has a show he has called Taste the Heat. And I chase the heat. Seems like a good cut of marriage, right? I'm going to be on his show. Um, after he gets back from the New York Expo, he's going to be doing a show with, with yours truly. So I hope you guys all tune in to watch that. That'll be kind of fun. But... <clears throat> Right here, a good burn. That's hot sauce. Um, not really getting an endorphin rush from that. I think the average person, if they just took three tea tablespoons of, I hope I didn't drink too much of this, would probably get an endorphin rush, but my tolerance is kind of high. But boy, it's got a good smell. The smell is all pepper and garlic. You can even smell it, Paul. You asked how much the how prominent the um, apricot is, but you can smell it. I mean, I'm convinced that most sauces taste like they smell. If you can smell the apricot, you're going to be able to taste the apricot. It's interesting if you if you um, if you put it. Some in your mouth, if you taste some, and you're thinking about garlic, that's what you're going to be tasting. If you taste some and you're thinking about the apricot, that's what you're going to be tasting. But the nice thing is, regardless of what you're thinking, the pepper's in your face. That's a hot sauce. I like it. So listen, Chris and Danielle Barlow, I want to thank you guys for sending this to me. I loved it. I thought it was great sauce. I really appreciate it. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this video right now. Um, I want you guys to go to the description box. Facebook, stay on if, for just a minute. But YouTube, go to the description box. Click on the link below. And you can get some of the sauce for yourself. Right here, you'll see a pepper floating. Click on that pepper. You become a subscriber to my channel. If you click on the little bell, it'll notify you when we have new videos we release. I want to thank you guys for joining me very much. This is Johnny Scoville. We'll catch you guys next time on Chase the Heat.